most popular expletive-filled clip ever shown by Christians and conservatives across the internet. <laughs> We're recording. I know. I don't even know if people... Hey, this is... Welcome. Welcome to the Good Life Midlife. I'm Tim. Hey, welcome to Midlife Good Life. I'm still Tim, and this is still... Susan. And we are... And... Adam. Wow. And... Oh, skipped on. Uh, he did. I'm Ashley. Thanks. It's the whole fam. It's the whole Fab Four. We're this in the, the car. the I think so. Hey! It's the whole family. And Ted is going to skip us. So anyhow, where are we going? We're on our way to... We are on our way to Opelousas. It is a family tradition that on Sundays of Memorial Day that we go to Opelousas and get Jimmy John's. Nothing says America quite like a Sunday afternoon trip to Opelousas to get Jimmy John's. And this is a family start tradition starting right Today. now. Because we've never done this before. Also, I probably won't make it next year. Why? Where are you going to be? I don't know. We'll have to see how this one turns out. To really see if I'm going to end this. I'm a, I'm <laughs> we'll see if we like it today. If we're going to make it a tradition starting um, next year. Yeah. All right. Tilling tradition. Yeah. So if, if this isn't a tradition, what is this? This is a rescue from lunch. Oh. Because I actually cooked, and where our vlog is always about going out to eat and like places that we've eaten, but I really, really cooked today. I like I cooked a legit meal. Yeah, what did you cook? It's just not done cooking. Well, what did you cook? Okay, my mom brought two roasts, the nice flat ones that get all shredded What's up. You know, one? I don't know if it's chuck roast. It's not a rump roast. Maybe a chuck roast. I don't know. Two of them. I went to high school with a guy named Chuck Roast. <laughs> I went to high school with a guy named Rump Roast. <laughs> it was his dad. Uh, okay. Um. So my mom brought me two of those roasts and I was gonna put them in the crock pot and I mixed the nice sauce that goes on them, like um, the three packet sauce, which is a packet of ranch, a packet of Italian, and a packet of brown gravy mix. You can also find this on Pinterest or Facebook and it makes really good juice. I've, um, my family likes it. I don't usually make it that way, but that's how I made it today. I prepped it last night, stuck it in the crock pot, put it in the fridge. This morning at 5.30, my alarm went off. I got out stumbling out of bed. Uh, you hopped out of bed. You I were did. ready to roll. You had this but I locked knew in. You were ready to go. I have to put the roast in at 5.30, so it'll be ready for 12.30. Seven hours on high. It so you were nice, on top of it. Tender, fall apart, tasty. Oh, man, it's yeah. going to be good. It is. Three packet, whatever. Roast. Roast, yeah. yeah. So anyhow, um, we got... No, then when I took you to church this morning yeah, and then I seven, got home, yeah. it was like 7 o'clock and I realized the crock pot had not been plugged in. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, we have one of those cock, crock pot brands that work better when they're plugged in. Yeah. yeah. So what happened is we got home from church. I knew it was cut short like an hour and a half from cooking. So when we got home, I started to take it out and while it's cooked and it's done, it was like incredibly tough and it needs to cook like three more hours probably. So, but we had the roast and I made rice. So we could have rice and gravy with the roast and I was making the green bean casserole and we could have gone and gotten some nice fresh raised bread and just had like good Sunday roast lunch. I feel like an egg that's sitting on that shoulder. An egg head? Just an egg. Get a little head. Look, let me hold your head. Trade signs with Adam next now time. Now listen, on the way back home. when we had three viewers, you were trying to hide back there. But now that we've hit the medium sized town, you you're you're one little air time. Yeah. I just needed to know that I was putting my name on something that would not be That has like that would be successful. I don't know how many views and followers now. But anyhow people sent us a cardboard play button. <laughs> 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 we have Dozens of views. Yes, <laughs> dozens. dozens. We appreciate all of you dozens. Um, so anyhow, so now we're on our way to Jimmy John's. And we're on the way to Jimmy John's because somebody, a dear friend, Lisa. But anyhow, she sent me a gift card to Jimmy John's for my birthday. And we haven't used it yet. And today it came in handy perfectly. Perfectly. So that's where we're going. Fantastic. And I like.
like Jimmy John's. So now, here we are at Jimmy John's, and I got the number five Italian, and what did you get, Ash? The number five Italian. What is it? It's pretty good. Yeah, can't really see it. Adam, what'd you get? I got a number 10 with nothing on it except for the meat and cheese. And how is it? It's all right. You'd like to have it toasted? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well. Next time I'll know. And what did you get? The number nine Italian. Oh. It's bigger than the number five Italian. It is by four. It's like a man sandwich. Hmm. All right. So we're done. We finished at Jimmy John's. I think three out of four of us enjoyed it. It was okay. You did not really like it. No. It was... Just because you've lived in the big city of Hattiesburg, oh, yeah. our small town delights oh, don't do you any good. That's it. Um, so Adam took a bite of his sandwich and then said, do you think they'll toast this? I'm pretty sure they're not going to toast it after your germs have been on the bread. So like you just better suck it up and eat it up, buttercup. So anyhow, but we all like it. We all get the Italian though. We like the Italian sauce. And um, I'm having a sweet tart rope for my finish it off. Three out of four of us in the car also like sweet tart ropes. This is going to make me sound really picky though. I like most things. I like lots of things. <laughs> there are things that I like. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. So um, now we're on our way home. So what's everybody going to do Sunday afternoon at 1.45? It's a tradition that on Sunday of Memorial Day that I get in my brown chair and I take a brief nap. It's not Memorial Day, though. It's every Sunday. Is today Memorial Day? Tomorrow is. Tomorrow, okay, Tomorrow yeah. Tomorrow is the Sunday of Memorial Day. Okay, uh, so the tradition of Sunday of Memorial Day is that you get in your brown recliner and take a nap. It's one of the 52 Sundays a year that I nap. So I hope y'all all are enjoying your Sunday afternoon. The four of us will. And uh, go and enjoy each other. We do. We do.